Hey everyone, it's Owen here from Otech, and today I'll be unboxing the Noise Blocker Black Silent Pro PL-2 fan from Noise Blocker. So this is a another premium fan from Noise Blocker, but this time it's a fan that has been co-produced or co-designed with the Hardware Lux Germany forum members of the. Uh, in the hardwarelux.de or from deluxe uh, from hardware lux in Germany so basically they collaborated with the forum members on what they want from a fan so they implement this all they want on this fan and yeah here's the specifications of the fan it's not a fast fan like it's just a 1400 rpm fan and the fan is just a 12 centimeter 120 millimeter fan as usual and the CFM is just 56.5 and it has a 1.44 watt uh, rating for the fan itself so it's not a fast fan nor it is uh, supposed to be a noisy fan but it's supposed to be a silent fan that should do a pretty good job on a radiator so here it is specifications and developed in Germany and here's the side you know silent frame Macrolon uh, material like the NBE loop as well so it's just their fancy plastic premium class high quality and yet another six year warranty on this fan and their noise blocker P2 drive uh, their nano SLI bearing uh, cable management and stuff it's basically the same standard stuff as they al you also find on their NBE loop fan and you know here it is uh, let's take a look inside so they actually include a lot of accessories so there's a really cool case sticker if you wanted to use it and then you also get this uh, fan rubber uh, isolator thing for your fan if you mount it to a radiator so that this fan would pretty much uh, seal off against the fan the, against the radiator and prevent any air leaks so you also get these extension like the NBE loops since this fan also doesn't have a long connector by default and you, got, you also got this uh, anti-vibration mount so already there's a lot more accessories to this fan compared to the NBE loop but yeah let's take a look at the fan itself and unfortunately the packaging is kind of worn up uh, kind of worn since it, I'm guessing this is, this is basically old stock and you know the cardboard is kind of brittle so when I took it out the first time it just kind of ripped off so yeah, unfortunately that happened, but the fan is fine, it's still the same fan, nothing wrong with it. So yeah, you can immediately see that the fan has a glossy black blade, which I think also looks really cool. It looks really nice, especially when you see uh, lights reflecting off the fan blades and if it's spinning. Uh, it looks really really cool in my opinion. And it's also not completely black, it's more like a dark uh, semi-transparent black it looks kind of like a smoked brown but in person it looks uh, a lot darker unless you put it in like brighter environment like this then you can really you can see the um, brownness of the fan blades a little bit but it's not nocturnal brown so yeah I think it looks pretty cool either ways and you know this is pretty simple fan by design just a normal fan blades and you know normal frame although the fan blade seems pretty slick you know in design so we'll see how that works once we try the fan there's not much to talk about about the design though it's pretty simple there's no even there's not even any anti-vibration stuff on the edges so yeah let's just give it a go and see how it does again let's start from the low speed and you can immediately see the fan starts off uh, with a low voltage so that's really good and I'm guessing that's one of the things that usually a lot of people requested which is a low starting voltage so they can undervolt and use the fan at a really low speed and trust me this is really slow like you can literally see the blades moving around although in the camera you kinda see like it's fast but it is really slow and there's also the PWM version which is uh, more advanced and you know slightly faster by 100 rpm I think it was 1500 rpm but yeah this is basically as fast as it as it can get for this model and even at full speed it's a uh, pretty quiet you know it's a pretty quiet fan you can't hear you can't hear a lot of anything from this fan 
not even wind noise it's basically because it's a pretty slow fan and at 1400 rpm it feels like it blows a lot more air than the NBE loop fan although I'm guessing the NBE loop would have a lot more static pressure although the fan blades on this fan is also quite wide and not a, quite a steep angle so it should probably do quite a good amount of static pressure as well although there's a kind of a huge gap between the frame frame of the fan and the fan blade itself so I'm not sure how does that probably doesn't help in static pressure but yeah it's a it's actually a pretty good high quality fan the bearing seems really smooth and it makes basically no noise although one thing to criticize about this fan is that you know I think the plastic isn't quite as good on at least my sample since it's kind of a little bit off balance I can feel the fan vibrating a little bit so yeah it's not a big deal though since the fan is quite slow so it won't even make any noise but yeah there it is it looks really cool when it's spinning much cooler than when it's not even spinning so yeah if you like this design you might want to pick one of these up and these are actually also quite popular in high-end builds so yeah that's it for this unboxing thank you for watching hope you enjoyed the video and if you do please click a like then also please click subscribe to see more of my future videos thanks for watching